This is Congressman Joe Courtney. I'm speaking to you on September 11, 2020, 19 years since the events took place at 9-11. I'm at the Enfield Fire Station, District 1, standing in front of a monument with two pieces from the Twin Towers, which again, the fire department here in Enfield worked very hard to recover and to, again, appropriately display uh, as a remembrance to 9-11. Uh, this year, in 2020, there obviously is an extra added um, characteristic, which is that there is no big crowd here today. There was no special event because of um, concerns over social distancing. And nonetheless, in some ways, I think um, the work that's being done today by uh, a lot of the same heroes of 9-11 are heroes today, the first responders the doctors, the nurses, the EMTs, uh, all the people who inspired us in their incredibly um, self-sacrificing actions in New York City and Washington, D.C. to uh, help um, both the survivors and those who we lost that day and their families. And it's a reminder that we should never take for granted um, those people who, again, are at the front lines of making sure that we are safe, uh, that we are healthy, um, and that we get through this experience of, of the coronavirus pandemic um, as swiftly and safely as possible. Again, we lost 156 people from Connecticut on 9-11. Uh, the pandemic has taken over 4,000 lives here in this state, uh, 190,000 this morning in, across the country. So again, thank you to all those first responders that are working so hard, even as I'm standing here today, uh, and again, your efforts are an inspiration to all of us that as Americans, we should come together because when we work together, we can overcome challenges like the events of 9-11 and like the pandemic in 2020. Thank you very much.